Well, it is still summer, but global shipping backups already threatening to steal Christmas, and some retailers are starting to panic. So let's bring in News Nation correspondent Tom Negevin. He is live in New York City tonight. Tom, what are those retailers telling you? You know, we found a lot more angst than we expected to, Nicole. This is pretty counterintuitive in midsummer, but a lot of retailers very concerned about keeping enough inventory on the shelves even now for Christmas time. Have a listen to this. I'm having a nervous breakdown from this. I'm not getting merchandise in. I'm not getting anything. It's a mess. It's a total, total mess. The owner of Han Bomb Toys here in New York not holding back in full panic mode with the holiday shopping season still four months away. Here's the issue, shipping and a global backlog caused by the pandemic. 2020 was bad, 2021 promises to be brutal. Manufacturers like Hasbro doing what they can to get Christmas toys and board games around the bottleneck, but even when merchandise gets to ports like LA, there often aren't enough longshoremen to offload the cargo. Suppliers say the plastics they need are being used to make syringes. It's a battle on many fronts. The bottom line, if you want to put something under the tree this Christmas, start planning and saving now. And the companies are now telling us that when you do get your new shipments in, the prices are going to be astronomical. We don't even know the percentage yet. It can go from 10, 20, 30 percent higher. You know what, industry analysts are actually very concerned about what we're seeing already at such an early stage in the year because they don't know how much higher prices are going to go, but they do know that toys are actually getting more expensive right now. The Wall Street Journal has done a ton of reporting on this, and they found one who said, uh, you know, we know Santa's going to fly this year. We just don't know what's going to be in the sleigh, Nicole.